that's Amari, that's Vanessa, that's Ava, that's me, and that's Chris. We're the family, travelling a million miles in our boat car. We hope you enjoy our journey. Hi guys, welcome back to Boat Car Adventures. If you're new to our channel, here's what it's all about. We've bought our first boat car. As a family of five, we've decided not to accept life's norm. We're searching for life's adventure, and sometimes that may take us inland or on water. Going up and down, there's a lot of debris in the river today. After having a difficult time over the past four weeks, I suggested that we do something a little bit out of the norm. So we left our boat car at the side of the road and took a ride on a steam train. It was chaos with the kids. Check out what happened next. What are you doing? I've just met Chris Sorry. Elaine with the lovely amphibious car. What a car! <laughs> I love my boats, but look at that. I've had boats all my life, but I've never had one like that. The lovely Pete runs the kiosk at the entrance of Swanage Railway. He gave the kids some ice creams and he gave us some coffees before we made our way to the platform. We are at Swanage Railway train station. Yep, and we're going to try it out today. Yeah. Another thing to do on the bucket list in Dorset. Definitely, especially because the kids are off on half term as well. So we thought, right, this is definitely one thing at least to get done. Yep. <laughs> so, yeah, just keep watching. <laughs> Because basically the engine will uncouple at that oh, end right. and it's oh. off the platform. Yeah. Right. But then they take it past the points up there, they run it round the loop, which yeah. is this other track over yeah. here. Yeah. It's going to go under that bridge. Yeah. As it's going back. backwards, you get a lovely photo. Before I could say Columbus is lonely, Chris is right up the, in there um, with the guys the steam in the engine room. Room. Okay, put water in the boiler. Yep. This one's for uh, steam heat to the coaches yep. during the winter. This one supplies all the steam to the brake system. Yep. Which is this. So these are just basically shut off valves. Shut off valves, right, brilliant. If we have a problem, we just shut them off. God, you've got a volcano in there. It's quite a get small the, Get the burgers in. Come on. Come on. What's the last time that done this for? Yeah, yeah. It's not our first time on the steam engine though, is it? Yeah, We've it been it? on one in Norfolk. Yeah, the Black Prince. The Black Prince. Which we will go on again at yeah, some point. Yeah, definitely. Very soon. And then, but now we're on the Marden. Marsden? Of course, it's not Marden. Anyway, we're on a train. Wow. And um, yeah. Yeah, so anyway, we went in the, into the, the cockpit. Yeah. On the, on the engine itself. Yeah. And, it's amazing. Brilliant. It's very hot. So hot. Yeah. I can stay there all day. So we've left our car back there. It is there and hopefully it will be fine. Um, Pete, Uncle Pete said he's going to look after it. So thank you, Uncle Pete. <laughs> so we're on our way now to Swanage. I think it's going to be about yep. a 
20 to, to 30 minute ride, I yeah. think. Mm -hmm. um, we were a little bit late leaving because we were taking up their time, I think. Yeah, <laughs> it was taking up the time. <laughs> but yeah, this should be a good journey. Yeah. So when we get there, of course, we will um, hook up with you guys and let you know what's, what's cracking. When we get there, I think we're going to check out the museum. Yep, check out the museum, have Probably a walk around. Go to the pier. Yeah, have a look at a couple of local businesses there. Yeah. See what's in the area. Yeah. And um, yeah, it's really good. Yeah, it's brilliant. So anyway, we'll um, yeah. get back to you in a minute. I thought we'd get to change the crossbar now. <laughs> Whilst Chris tried to run some joke, the ticket porter checked that we were all legal. During the journey, we sighted many hills and streams. We had finally arrived at the strong country. Jurassic Coast. If anyone knows the real history of Swanage, let us know. I've been told it's probably to do with smuggling, but that's all. Um, I'm not sure. Let us know. Right, we're on the High Street in Swanage, and we're just gonna take a walk down then see basically what's in the area Greg's, it's got a Greg's and all that got a lot of independent clothes on food shops a salt pig three pounds each, oh really nice three pounds what? big though they're probably not. None of the burgers, steak burgers, but no. Right, so let's close. I think. Yeah, let's close. Oh, that like, tenery. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. That's right. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> That's fine. Oh, Daisy. Daisy. <laughs> All right, there. Right, gonna walk to Brook Tea Rooms. I've been told this is really, really nice. Local independent tea rooms. We, we was gonna go there and support, but um, seems like they're closed at the moment. So we'll come here. <laughs> I like this. Look. Please don't feed me. It affects my health. It encourages me to steal food and waste. <laughs> It makes us goals aggressive towards humans. It causes a nuisance. That sounds like humans, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that sounds like a human. Not the Sorry, seagull. I'm a bit wrapped up at the moment. Oh, she's still, she's still not. Don't feel well. Elaine's not well at the moment. Some yeah. We don't normally take tablets anyway, but no. on this occasion, she wants to get. Really bad. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, look at the look at the views there, guys. Just to show you guys from Swanage. Amazing beaches. Where we normally talk to you guys, we're normally right over that end. When we sometimes do our vlogs in the mornings, which is beautiful. And the water's always clear, isn't it? Yeah. Always clear, but we're going to take a walk around there and over to the pier and see what's at the end. Let's go. Walking along the seafront. 
got to take the boat car here one day, innit, Mari? Mm -hmm. Yep, slipway. There's a slipway here. Yeah. We can literally drive, it's good to know. We could literally drive down here and into the water. We can stop the sea flooding in the town. Yeah, sea defences. Right, it's quite good they've actually put sea defences along here. It's obviously in stormy weather, it does get really hard around here, and obviously these blocks. Stop the sea from coming over and flooding the town over there, so it's quite interesting. This is a tram just to run along here. Alright, this one is Museum and Heritage Centre. Yeah. Right, right. yeah. It's not stopping in it. This museum's really cool, it's got a lot, quite a lot of um, stuff which way before our time. Some military clothes up there. There's books you can buy, or even free leaflets I think, a mixture of both. I think these are to buy. Or to buy, yeah. And I think that's one of the trains we went on, that is the actual train we went on. <laughs> and that's obviously a star of the show. And, oh, hang on, <laughs> I actually thought that was a real person. <laughs> Really cool. It Good. is. Lloyd's. Oh, Lloyd's <laughs> They've been around a long time, and I wonder if she's been around as long as Lloyd's has. <laughs> Do you remember these snuff box things? I think that's what it is. It is, I think. Yeah, yeah. little snuff box things there. Why did they have them? I, mean, I don't know if you put it in the note. I don't know if like, it's cold. I think it's cold, I'm not sure. Coronation tea, again, that birds, evolves, twinings, still around. Earl Grey, I don't like. I'm quite intrigued with track the cabbage lions are still around. Welsh the the don they just donated some donation box. Alright, and that will be archive thing. Box scope, not for there. Yeah. yeah, it's just so that you look in look at archives and stuff, I think. And my moving picture machine. Oh, some pictures. <laughs> Donate artifacts in here, or yeah, people give donations. Yeah. Oh, fantastic! Yeah, oh, brilliant. It's all, um, we're all volunteers, and it's all donations. Yeah, yeah. Brilliant. Sometimes you can get a Yeah, brilliant. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Oh, fantastic! Have a nice day, you too. Yeah, for a day, we came to train on the railway. Oh, yeah, oh fantastic! Yeah, brilliant. Thank you. Have a good day. Uh, see front, and the sea comes over here. They've even got sea defence bits of put in the toilets. I'm not sure if you have to pay to go on the pier or not, but um, we're going to have a look anyway. <laughs> we're here promoting the area, so no landing without permission from divers down. Who's got a plane? Anyone got an aircraft? No. No. <laughs> Thank you. 
Right, so we're walking on the pier. This one is pier. West towards the town. support the pier in Swanage you can actually pay I believe to have a memorial plaque, um, plaque put on the, on the on the slats here so um, yeah it's important to support them as well get in touch if you live in the area or you just want to put a plaque here in memory of someone you've lost in the past or someone who's dear to yourself yeah keep going that's all shut at the moment. Can't go down there, but I think you can on a good day when the boat comes in. And obviously we can, you can get a boat from here to pool. They do a boat, I think it's every couple of hours, I think it is. I'm not sure how many hours. Um, I think, yeah, the Swanage, the big Swanage one. Right, what do you think, guys? It's scary. I like, I like being on the water, <coughs> over the water. It's clean, it's fresh. Yeah, this is Swanish Pier and then um, yep. we finally made it. Very fresh out here today. Yep, Lady's um, still not feeling well, so she's really trying hardest to very hard. keep up the content. But the weather's nice. Yep. The clouds, it's, it's a little bit cloudy, but you know, it's it's nice. Can't complain, it's not raining. <laughs> yep, definitely. Um, but yeah, we're out. I think we're going to have to get our boat car in here at some point. Definitely. It's a nice harbour. To cruise yeah. around, it's always flat because, um, what's it all always, but no, you know, yeah. <laughs> a lot of time it is because it's in the bay, it's in a really deep bay as well, so that keeps the water and then um, this little contains the waves a little bit more. So, we finally made it to Swanage Pier in Swanage. Come down and, um, yeah, come and check it out. So, no, we're, sure, we're not sure if you've got to pay to come on to the pier, yeah. Um, you may need to donate to the trust, yeah. But you know, obviously, that's something that you will see when you get to the gates yeah but you know it is a beautiful place as you can see the views are amazing yeah you know and Definitely. most times in Swanage most times we've come here the it's weather's been good really nice yeah. and even it isn't the sea's still lovely it's always turquoise blue here yeah. even today it's very cold yeah and it's very nice so I'll come check it out definitely it's one of my favorites um, especially we do a lot of vlogging from here in the mornings on the way through for going somewhere um, um, it's a really nice place to start very nice peaceful Serenity, it's so Open. quiet, yeah. so quiet here, it's unbelievable and the people are really nice here as well. Definitely. Bit oldie worldy, worldy oldly, what's the what's the name? Old worldy oldie. Worldly oldly. Oh, oldie worldly. Oh yeah. <laughs> Which is good. It's yeah. not a negative, it's really good, I enjoy it. Yeah. And um I enjoy the place, yeah. So guys, yeah, come and check it out in Dorset, Swanage. Yeah. I've looked at the map next to uh, it's before Weymouth and after Bournemouth. Yeah. Um, Wareham. So yeah, check it out. And obviously Wareham's lovely, which we'll do another video on that. Definitely. Another walk down the street of Wareham. So Wareham. we're going to stop at the cafe on the way down to yeah. buy a cake because of course we are supporting the local. We did also donate obviously to the local which is good. museum. Yep. So, um, you know, we are contributing to the local economy. Yep. But also we need to catch our train back. Yeah, we need to catch our train back. So we need to make so a move on. All right. <laughs> Yep, there he is. Captain Pugwash, the car park attendant. <laughs> well, he's retired now anyway. There's quite a lot of stuff you can do. Um, diving, um, you can uh, uh, catamaran go fishing, etc, etc. Water sports.
Oh, there's other shops down there. Oh, not much this way. <coughs> Around the back here, there's quite a lot of independents. Which, to be fair, they should promote on the ice street a bit more. These are on the back and they're not getting seen. Oh yeah. What's that? Emporium. Oh, to look at it's an emporium now. Um, they sell stuff, I think, in the boxes, but they've gone. They've relocated the parent. There must be an emporium down here as well. Oh, this must be Imperium. This must be the Imper Emporium name. Uh, nice art gallery there. Wow, look at that. Right, this place called a Chococo. It's supposed to be really good and it makes a fine fresh chocolate. Oh, they actually make it here. The ice cream must come in all the time when we've got more time. We'll definitely make it a thing to come back. Yeah. And, um, <coughs> yeah. Brilliant. So, yeah, we'll make a date with this and come back and try it out. Definitely. Right, we've got a train to catch. We have Lane. got a train to catch. For the run out of steam, literally. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Oh, that's our train. That's our train. That's when we came on. <coughs> that's when we came on, though, yeah. So, I'm gonna find out this guy is. It's um, Matthew, uh, Martin. This shop's not even open. It should be open. We're not being open today. This is just this a put across it as well, isn't it? Come, come together, Mari. Oh, oh, we've got. Come in, cross, quick cross. Wait, 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 don't run. Come here, come here, stop. Do you need Yeah, let's sit there. Yeah. Alright, that's what we're having something to eat. We're having something to eat. Sandwich. We didn't have time to go and get something to eat at the cafe, but we'll be back. Little Columbus sitting somewhere in the field. <laughs> Wait, waiting for us to get back. <laughs> <laughs> that car's never left its own, is it? It's always been by, it's all part of my family. Mm. So. We're going to go back and get Columbus and carry on our journey.
Hvad er det? Yeah, get in, Chris. <laughs> Chill out. Right. guys we are here back at our starting point beautiful journey definitely we'll be doing this again So guys, yep, we've done it. We've done it. We've come on the we've um, got Swanage Railway. Yep, Manston, oh, Manston, Manston, Manston train. There's a train which is in the background. Yep, absolutely fantastic. One thing I've learned about being on a steam train is do not stick your head out of a window because you get bits <laughs> of coal or whatever soot in your eyes. But it smells amazing. It does it? smell nice. Oh, it smells like there's no nice season yeah, fires. Almost yeah, but it's that steamy. Fire yeah, smell. I'm. Oh, I'm to be honest with you, I'll be really honest with you. I didn't want to come on this trip. <laughs> I'll be re really, really honest with you. I didn't want. Not like I love trains, but I wasn't really. I always want to go on the water or near the beach. And Lane was like, "Let's go in a bit and do something different <laughs> to our channel because we are traveling in a boat car and it is an adventure. So we are showing, you know, land, sea, what water, whatever we got to do. But this was different, and I actually want to go on it again. <laughs> share the love, share the knowledge, and please remain human. And keep checking. And keep checking. <laughs> so we made our way back to Columbus, who was faithfully waiting for our return. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next week on our next adventure. <laughs>